Can you make it a notch? Going ham with Superman. <laughs> YouTube lad, <lab, man. laughs> Okay, so got a uh, light week this week. Uh, you know, I just recently got my uh, Ruger American uh, boat action 308 rifle. Um, and first, first out of the range, uh, you know, it fired well, uh, no issues there or anything like that. But, uh, I know I realized I needed something, uh, for if I want to, you know, go prone with it or just, you know, tabletop with it and instead of using the, uh, rifle rest at the range, I want to get, uh, a bipod. So I went with a, just easy to get called well um little bipod and you know uh i think it's probably like the cheapest one on the market but i don't i don't see anything wrong with it um and also you know it came with this little three round mag and i and if you've been watching you know i got, I got drums for pretty much everything um i i got but can find a drum for it, but I did find a five round, got a five rounder and a 10 rounder. So, um, you know, I had to, of course, test those out. They're both, uh, Ruger mag. So, uh, and the, the 308s. So when shouldn't have been any issues with them and there wasn't, uh, got them loaded in just fine. And, um, they fed just fine. With a boat action, I, I doubt you have any any real troubles with feeds, but um, you got you got better control over. But uh, yeah, just took it out. I think I sighted um the uh scope in a little better, the Bushnell uh, scope that came with it. Uh, sighted it in just a little more. I uh, still not zero uh because it's my first time using a bipod like this. Uh. <laughs> I sighted it in, but uh, not realizing that once I go bipod and I got that tilt going, I need to aim lower um, in order to hit. So uh, I don't know if I want to sight it based off the bipod or if I want to uh, just leave it where it is because I probably be more, more shoulder fired than I would um, proned out or... Uh, on the table with it so thinking i'm just gonna leave leave the sights where it is but um i just know that if i'm proned out or whatever aim low um so that's my little spill on that nobody told me <laughs> but yeah it's a good little bipod there too though uh shoots out to i think like nine nine inches and then it's got different uh levels you can bring it up to so you, uh, it starts off at like six inches and then so you can just bring it down to whatever needs you have from the nine all the way back down to the six and just uh rock out however you need to so, yeah, they lock back in there fold right up for easy carrying storage so yeah it doesn't really take up a lot more space uh you know on the bottom and then this is is my first because you know my other rifles are like Picatinny uh, rail systems and stuff. So this is my first uh, swivel, swivel mountain. We got that one there, and then there's the one in there. It was um, fairly easy to install as well. Um, it's just got the little clamps uh, that go onto the swivel mountain, and you just tighten it down with the nut there, and you're pretty much good to go. I might, I might have to do a short or something, um, showing how to put that together. But, but no, I, um, uh, I, I think I'm gonna enjoy it. Like I said this is my first boat action, and I don't have any complaints out of it so far. Uh, I think I got probably about a good 50 rounds through it so far. 308 ammo is expensive, uh, so so 50 rounds of 308, you know, is good for me. I still got it. I, I don't like to be empty. I don't like, so everything I got. I got I got ammo for it at home. I never I never empty out at the range. So I always I leave the range with at least one mag and I got I make sure I have enough to have all my mags um full at home. 
Um, now, if I don't have any extra after that, then I might have to go and stock up a little bit. But that's that's another little um, helpful hint. <laughs> it's just uh, never such thing as too much ammo. Uh, so yeah, I, and that's another thing. Don't don't leave the range empty. I I, I hate that. I, you know, like dollar cup and leaving empty, leaving naked. I don't like feeling naked walking walking out leaving the range. So um, I always have something on because I. I I just got one of those weird minds that's always thinking about the worst scenario that and it'll look bad too you know I, I go to the range and empty out everything and then i, I walk down the parking lot somebody robs me and, <laughs> and i'm just sitting there and i just can't defend myself or do nothing um so i never leave empty never leave empty so that's that's a hint for you guys don't leave empty but Again, I appreciate everybody, though, for tuning in this week. I appreciate everybody for all your likes, shares, subscribes, your, your views. Um, I just can't, can't thank you enough. But um, uh, just enjoy the footage of the boat action here. And I'm out.